beautiful. So coming back to our bodies again, taking a nice comfortable position, getting a sense of your whole body, <clears throat> relaxing yet being in an alert position, present and awake, focusing your attention on your eyes and just relaxing the muscles around your eyes. Our eyes do so much for us the whole day. Checking in with your jaws, just releasing all the tension, noticing taste buds feeling in your tongue, and letting your tongue rest at the root of your mouth, just relaxed, open. And rolling your shoulder back, flexing and feeling that openness, that space, the simple movement creates in your chest. And dropping the shoulders, letting them sit nicely, relaxed. Flexing your arms, loosening your palms, placing them wherever they want to. Letting go of your belly, and relaxing whole of your legs. Checking in with your spine, aligning very nicely with your neck, the whole of your head. And setting this kind intention for your practice. It's time for homecoming. It's time for self-healing. Bringing your attention to the very top of your head, just two inches above. And feeling a sensation, the energy, the flow of energy rushing through top of your crown and showering through inside and outside of your body. With a smile, accepting this beautiful flow of universal energy that's always available. Thanking Mother Earth, thanking yourself for taking the seed of awareness. Notice the tingling sensations, vibrations in your body. That's the aliveness of your life, the life that is inside of you. It's making itself known through these bodily and inner sensations. I'm practicing a calming, relaxing breathing technique to really connect and let go, establish yourself in this awareness that you are. Inhaling slowly and gently and exhaling a smooth, gentle out breath. becoming familiar with the natural rhythm of your breath. Just noticing how the breath is. What is the quality of your breath? Recognizing that your breath is always there for you. It's the vital forces of life that is keeping you alive, giving you this experience on this planet. 
hearing the message of your breath. I'm here for you, darling. I'm here for you. Practicing few in-breaths and out-breaths. The count of three, four, five. Whichever is most comfortable and beneficial for you. Breathing in up to the count, two, three, four, five. And breathing out with the same count, matching the out breath with the in breath. And again, experiencing this without trying or striving to match the out breath with in breath. Noticing the sensations the breath creates in your body. Noticing how it feels. Nice, smooth, slow. Inhalation, matching the exhalation. Now behind the closed eyes or open eyes, noticing what can you see? Who is looking through these closed or open eyes? And what are you looking at? Recognizing this subtle separation on who's watching and what are you looking at the r recognizing of rain it's all about noticing and recognizing who are you and what are the different elements that are a part of you. Just noticing, just reflecting on the inquiry. Who's watching? What are you looking at? With your in breath, picking up any fragrances, aromas, and noticing the fresh air filling up your lungs, sensing the vibrations, the air around you. And we'll invite three sounds of the bell. And again, recognizing the subtle difference between the sounds that you hear and who is the one that's hearing it. Can you become one with sound? What happens with this merger? And letting the sound go now. And bringing whole of your attention to the whole of your body. Noticing all the contact points 
with the support that's holding you, caressing you, noticing the touch of the contact points. And recognizing who's noticing this touch, the sensations, who is receiving the support. Connecting with Mother Earth. Noticing now the difference between the floor that you're sitting on and, and your tailbone, the very last bone of your spinal cord connecting you with the earth beneath you. And now relaxing and releasing in every in-breath and out-breath and melting further and further into Mother Earth. As if you're melting your whole being into her. Feeling there is no difference between who you are and your body and the earth beneath you. Merging with Mother Earth and Noticing how this union, this homecoming feels in your body, in the form of sensations, tinglings, noticing your mental activities have they calmed down just before you started the practice. Is there any sense of who's experiencing all of these different experiences in each moment? I'm smiling to every new moment, every new experience. Letting go, letting go, letting go. Every out breath, a sense of release. And every in breath, a sense of relaxing the whole body, calming the mind, allowing space for all that is there inside of you. Noticing the mind may wander from time to time, just doing its thing. Noticing different layers of mind. The one that creates thoughts. The one that's enabling you to experience this awareness that you are. Recognizing this layers of different minds that are all present in you. And again, setting this beautiful inquiry. Who am I? Who's that me? With a pure mind experiencing all of these awareness. And with a personal mind that may distract you from time to time. And that's okay. Just noticing, recognizing, and knowing that your beautiful breath is your anchor. And science tells us now that in one conscious in-breath and out-breath, our mind instantly comes back to our body. 
experiencing the power of this true will of the conscious breathing, just one breath, bringing you back home, your whole being. And if breath may not be accessible, then just anchoring on any of your five senses that are so powerful to drop you in the present moment, any time. Always available in the here and the now. Or through the bodily sensations and focusing on those sensations. These are the messages from your body communicating with you. Anytime you can be present to listen. Just anchoring yourself on any of these beautiful parts of you that are available. Establishing yourself on your seat of awareness, the consciousness, the being that you are who experiences everything that goes in your mind, in your heart, in your body. Simply recognizing and experiencing this recognition. Letting your awareness guide you every moment. And checking in now with very gentle, very kind curiosity and openness. What is the state of my being? How is it in there? Without personal mind letting you get stuck in any judgments or stories or thoughts. Stepping into the awareness that you are that is more powerful than anything that goes inside and outside and touching that life that you are. And placing this gentle inquiry. What is the state of my being? How does it feel to be in here? And it may be pleasant, it may be unpleasant, or just neutral. The collective energy of our group may be holding in the present moment and there may be just a stillness and that's all welcome. Recognizing the state of your being now. And if anything feels a bit much, then without a need to understand, just releasing, releasing, letting go. Who's in there who's experiencing? And how do they want to experience this? Touching the power of life that you are beyond any external situations, any thoughts, any feelings. No 
noticing this power of true will. The awareness that can just experience everything inside and outside. And yet choose to relax and release. Noticing these different sensations in the body, there may be a particular part, maybe your throat, your chest, stomach. That may be vibrating or there may be a tension or in your shoulders back of your neck, the usual habitual contraction points. And releasing, bringing that universal flow of energy that you experienced before on top of your head and allowing that flow of energy to be guided through these body parts, supporting them, relaxing them, and allowing the release to happen. There is no need to hold back. You can let go. You can release, it's okay. okay. And again for a minute, giving yourself support of your breath. The in-breath and the out-breath matching together and enjoying the sensation the beautiful energy that the breath flows just simply for enjoying your breath. Simply being here. The energy force that's always there with you, guiding you. sense of relaxation in the in-breath, the sense of relaxing, releasing in the out-breath. And when you feel ready, once again, collecting all the attention and bringing it inwards. Just resting there for a while. Recognizing this energy push that there might be to make you feel uncomfortable or pushing you to think about or solve something. And it's very interesting, just with loving kindness, noticing, recognizing that energy, that push that, that's wanting to be released. And if there is stillness, there is restfulness, recognizing that and enjoying it. And if it feels okay, again, placing an inquiry with curiosity. What is happening inside of me today? Noticing any feelings or emotions if they're coming out. Only calling them by their true names. 
without going into stories. Just checking in the internal weather again and recognizing how it may be different from just five minutes back or it could be the same. Noticing that everything is only an experience, either pleasant, unpleasant, or neutral. It's all welcome and it's all fine. And recognizing that it changes its nature of impermanence, shifting from moment to moment or from minute to minute. And smiling to that wonder, of the shift of energy. How beautiful is that? How wondrous. and relating it with the experience of your day-to-day -day life. Recognizing how it is no different from what happens outside to what happens inside. It's all energy shifting, changing, transforming from moment to moment, from experience to experience. And that is all there is. Bringing in the perspective of our blue and green planet hanging in the black space, middle of nowhere. It's bringing this vision to your mind and recognizing how this perspective shifts what you noticed just before. Recognizing that there is just space and space beyond and far our whole planet. And the nearest star is a billion years anywhere from the central point and feeling the sensations in your body. Are you here experiencing all of that? Recognizing the vastness, the spaciousness of your being that can experience that is beyond your mind, your heart, your body. Those are parts of you. And your whole being is this awareness, this consciousness that can experience all of this all at the same time. It's allowing your body to receive this powerful recognition for a minute. And notice what happens inside, how it shifts. What is the sense of your being noticing this? And right from this vast space around Mother Earth, where we don't know what's up, what's down, 
what are the different directions, where to go, where is the beginning, where is the end. It's a circle of healing. A circle of healing that is all around you. Amidst any internal or external experience. And recognizing now how it feels in there. The being who's experiencing the subtle separation of who you are, who you truly are, and all the other things that you experience, life experiences. Noticing if there is any sense, any possibility of acceptance, of allowing that comes in for all these different experiences. And what does that tell you about who you really are beyond any of these internal and external movements? Coming back to our key inquiry, that is our practice for the whole week. What is the state of my being? Now, in the present moment. And what is happening inside of me? Simply recognizing. And at any point, if it feels overwhelming, then bringing in the sense of release. Practicing relaxing in breath, and releasing out breath and letting go of all that's holding you back. Smiling again to this new experience, to this new release, experiencing that it is available every moment. You only need to recall it. No need to understand, no need to analyze at this point. Only recognition. And allowing yourself to sit in silence for a couple of minutes and Soaking in this experience, touching the awareness that you are. The awareness that's aware that you are aware. And also the awareness that that is aware even when you're not aware. couple of minutes of silence.
very gently, very kind, bringing your attention back to your body, noticing the flow of your in breath and out breath, going down in your body and coming back up. Recognizing that awareness is always there. You can step into it anytime, consciously. And that makes recognition possible. The being you are is always aware. Bringing that awareness into your consciousness now. To be able to recognize the separation between the experiences and the one who experiences them. And that's where lies your power, your freedom, your free will. The difference, the pause between stimulus and response. And in that gap is your ability to choose the freedom and the peace. Becoming aware of the sounds around you. Sound of your breath maybe any sounds in your external environment, birds singing, the wind blowing, noticing all the contact points of your body, at your back, sitting bones, legs, consciously connecting with the gravity ground you, center you. And if it feels okay, just putting your hand on your heart or on your belly wherever to bring this homecoming, closing the circle of healing. Taking a moment to thank yourself for practicing, for taking this courageous feat to experience, to get familiar with your awareness. And when you feel ready, very slowly taking your own time, fully coming back in your body, the room you are in, gently opening your eyes or keeping them closed for a while if you wish. Making movements, gentle movements, wriggling your fingers, toes, preparing your body to come back, stretching, Making any movements in your shoulders and welcoming yourself back into the full awareness.